I'm John Alexandrov, business coach and attorney. Most of you know me as the CEO of REIC. Uh, many of you have either seen me speak at speaking engagements throughout the U.S. and Canada. Uh, maybe you've been one of our group coaching programs. And uh, you also know that uh, over time, many people go to our website, reicconnect.com, and they send in questions. They watch former videos. Uh, they inquire about coaching. And several of the questions that come up during that process, I like to get onto video so uh, you can hear the information and also share it with other people. So please feel free to share this info with others. Um, the question that I received recently is, how do I know if I'm hiring the right person? Now, as, as business people and entrepreneurs, that's an age old question, isn't it? You know, we, we believe we do the best job possible of screening and hiring people, but it doesn't always work. There are ways, however, to increase your probability that you are hiring the right person for the position that you have available. One of them, obviously, is to check their experience, their testimonials or their references. Uh, but a third way would be to give them a, some sort of personality profile or personality assessment during the hiring process. Uh, I, uh, for, for our company, as well as for our, our, many of our clients, uh, we have their prospective employees take a personality profile, a DISC assessment, and we interpret that with the client so that they know what the basic character type is, the value system, uh, the communication style of the people that they're thinking about hiring. And there's also a website out there, and there are probably multiple of these, called proveit.com. And on these websites, so some, let's say someone were to say to you they have a certain skill set. Well, you can go online and have them tested and prove that they really have the skill set that they say that they have. So if someone says that uh, they can type you know, 150 words per minute, well, you can send them to proveit.com and they'll have them take a test and they'll make them prove it. Or if they say they're an expert at Excel, well, you can send them to proveit.com or, or other websites and test them for that skill. So, listen, is the hiring process perfect? No, of course not. However, there are ways to improve your probabilities of hiring the right person. Now, of course, in my opinion, the number one thing that you should be doing, you know, even higher than skill set, experience, all of those things is, are you hiring a person that's a match to the culture of your organization? Because if somebody's not a match to the culture of your organization, they can have the right skills, they can have experience and all that stuff, but they're really not gonna fit in. You know, they're really not gonna fit in with the organization. They're really not gonna get what's going on in your company and how you run your business. So the first thing, in my opinion, is are they a fit to the culture? Do they have the same work ethic? Do they have the same, are they, they gonna buy into your vision? You know, what type of character they have, do they have? Is that character a match to the culture in your organization? And then after that, of course, skill set, experience, all of those things. But the bottom line is make sure that you're doing some sort of personality or character assessment. And two, make sure that the person that you're thinking about hiring is a really good fit to the culture of your organization.